Hi, my name is Curran Kara, and I've just finished the second year of my economics degree. The transition from A-level to university can be tough in so many respects, especially academically with your workload. So today I'm going to give you guys some tips on how to manage your degree's workload. So first of all, I keep a daily checklist on my phone in the notes app uh, that I tick off as I go through the day. And the trick with this is to make it as visible as possible. So either make it on your lock screen or your home screen, somewhere where you'll see it consistently and frequently through the day. So um, because you've got this checklist, um, it means you're, you've got everything you need to do for the day. And as you check it off, make it a manageable but also challenging checklist. So when you are finished with it and you've ticked everything off, you feel a sense of achievement. My second tip is having a dedicated workspace. Now, because of COVID, um, everyone's leisure space and workspace merged because everyone was working from home, a place that I think most people associate with rest and uh, relaxation and switching off after a long day. So uh, if you can and are able to find maybe a specific desk or a specific room that can be psychologically really beneficial to your work rate. This is quite a cliche one, but creating a routine or a structure or a timetable um, for working. At least with me, I find my vote my motivation varies through the day and through the week. Like some days I'll feel really up for working, really energetic and getting work done, and other days I won't. It's very easy to work only when you feel like and and that can often lead to a lot of procrastination and ultimately work getting done like just before deadlines rather than well in advance. So having a routine or a schedule in place where you dedicate a specific time and put your mind at work will be really beneficial. My next tip is to distribute your credits of modules uh, equally across both semesters. Uh, last year in my second year in autumn, I made the mistake of giving myself too little work to do in autumn and then in spring I gave myself way too much work which was an unhealthy workload and very difficult to handle all of it whilst maintaining like a balance of any sort. But definitely I recommend consulting your tutor on your module choices and getting their opinion on whether they think you've distributed your credits evenly or balanced enough. Be sure to ask them whether they think the workload will be manageable. It's very important to get this right early rather than late. Finally I just want to emphasize it's okay to be struggling with your workload when you arrive at university or when or even if you're at the end of university. Degrees put a far greater emphasis on independent study and self-learning far more than A level. It, it's a massive step up from A level and it's a very hard transition for many. I, I mean I struggled straight away. It was very daunting at first making notes from lectures, doing the tutorial questions. I, I, I was a mess at the beginning. But although it's a big step up, the university does provide you support and the services you need in order to make this transition from A level to university far more seamless. For example, uh, there are interactive engagement sessions where you ask your uh, lecturers after the lectures have been posted questions about certain parts of the lectures you didn't get. And yeah, they're very beneficial for understanding those certain parts or theory that you didn't quite get. The university also has a counseling service that run workshops on various issues including uh, managing your workload and uh, just managing the general study pressures that come with a degree. You can always also talk to your personal tutor about these issues, they're always there for you and their job is to be there for you regarding any queries or questions or problems you're having and also the university has a support and well-being a service specifically dedicated to students. The workload seems very daunting and tricky at first, but it's very important to remember you are in the University of Nottingham because of your great work ethic and efforts during A-level. Always remember you made it here on merit, you deserve to be here and you're capable of achieving great things. So even though it might be daunting at first or difficult at first, you can do it, you can get through it. it you've got all the support around you and with hard work, you can achieve really great things at this university. Thanks for watching guys, um, shameless plug, but I also make YouTube videos on my own channel, Current Carer, uh, where I uh, give advice and tips for economics degrees specifically, as well as general university advice and some additional bits uh, along the way. But yeah, hopefully this video was useful and uh, thanks for watching and all the best for your degrees ahead.